The first surge about this antique marketplace after the business was burglarized on Easter. The owner took her frustrations to city council and is now meeting with Auburn police. Fox 13's Jennifer Dowling shows us some changes that are underway and how she's taking security into her own hands. Carly Willis installed this thick wire over the window that thieves broke into a few weeks ago. She says there's also been more police patrols in the area. She says that's a start. When Carly Willis gets ready to close Antique Marketplace in Auburn, she now pulls this accordion-style metal gate over the doors as an added layer of protection. When she first opened, she wanted customers to feel like they could exit the outside world and take a break inside. She feels the gate stands in contrast to that mission. And now it feels like they're being enclosed, and I hate that. Hog wire has also gone up over the windows. The whole length, all 12 of my windows. She started horrifying the marketplace after thieves smashed through a window Easter weekend, stealing jewelry and leaving behind thousands of dollars in damages. It'll at least slow them down. No guarantees, but it's it's all I can do at this point. Willis has called on the city at council meetings to do more to fight crime. This week, the chief of police met with business owners to explain what's being done. They've been doing an emphasis on this area. Willis says the patrols may be helping as incidents of drug use, shoplifting, and theft seem to have declined. It sounds like they've made contact with about 200 people um, outside of any arrests or anything like that. Um, and it does seem to have helped in the last couple weeks. So I am thankful for that. Still, she says business owners here are talking about hiring additional private security. Really, it's us against the world at this point. They made it pretty clear in the meeting that they can't really do anything more than they're doing. She says she'll also continue to try to secure her business as best she can. I haven't had any break-ins, but as you can see, I got my wire up. <laughs> so nothing I ever wanted to do, but here we are. So we have. Um, everywhere. <laughs> just, it's it, this self approach on things, man. It's like, when are these people going to get mad? And like this in March and the same energy they had to march and protest for fucking Sun Man crackhead that died. Like, where's the protest? I did. I would be irate if I was her, man. Like, it's everywhere they're ruining everything. They're ruining everything. <laughs> 